Good morning, traders. Well, Asian equities are looking to open up this morning as the Wall Street rally continued last night on some soft US data. FX markets were very choppy, though, with uh, the Federal Reserve entering its blackout period, so that you'd expect that probably to continue until next week. Um, dollar was US dollar was flat on Monday. Dollar index trading either side of that psychological 100 level. Very low volatility tight range session. Highs were seen early in the session before uh, when Treasury yields were their highest before pairing gains to trade sub 100 for the rest of the session. Euro US saw marginal gains holding above that psychological 112 handle throughout the session. We had ECB's Nagel uh, spoke once again, quite hawkish once again, saying he expected a, a hike in July, 25 basis points. Um, and doesn't see a risk of over tightening. So that also bolstered the uh, the euro somewhat. Um, also outperforming the pound with that euro pound cross in a pretty choppy session, um, rising to find, brought found a bit of selling around the 86 level. Aussie and Kiwi generally softer against the US dollar, um, failing to benefit from that risk on sentiment with the upside in US stocks as both of them falling victim to that soft Chinese data earlier in the Asian session. Um, Aussie dollar briefly lost hold of that 68 level um, and the, the Kiwi down to 63 before finding a bit of support. Aussie Kiwi did rise again a little slightly, uh, moving above that midpoint for your, you mean reversion traders out there. Commodities, are, oil was probably the most interesting market overnight. Um, initially weaker on with that Chinese data and we had a, a big spike in the European session on reports that Saudi Arabia were extending their production cuts. but that report was quickly retracted and, and oil dropped back down to earth. Uh, today's economic announcements, probably the RBA is one that would uh, be the most interesting with the markets, are, well, they're releasing their minutes from the, the July meeting. So markets are pretty split as to, to their next move in a couple of weeks, around 25% of a, of a hike. So could see some good volatility in the Aussie dollar around the release of those at 11.30 a.m. Australian Eastern time.